Karibuni na habari za asubuhi. Tupo kwenye habari za mchana. Kondrabi. Uh, tupo kwenye mkutano kuelekea mchezo namba 206 wa ligi kuu ya NBC kati ya Azam FC ambao ni wenyeji, wenyeji kutoka kule Azam Complex Chamazi ambao wanakwenda kuwakaribisha Simba Sports Club eh, kwenye mchezo huu ambao utachezwa kwenye uwanja wa Azam Complex kesho kuanzia majira ya saa moja usiku. Tunakwenda kuzungumza na makocha ama nahodha wa timu hizi mbili eh, watueleze namna ambavyo wamejiandaa kuelekea mchezo huu. Coach uh, Mentioning the one of the NBC Premier League crucial games, very attractive. Azam FC versus Simba Sports Club is one of them. Uh, how was your two days in training? Yeah, as you said, it's a very attractive game. We are going to face the second and the third teams uh, in the table right now. They have a very good team, good professional players, good Tanzanian players, good young talents, a good coach. I think he's bringing a lot of freshness. Now they are changing some of the uh, behaviors they had in the first leg when we faced them or when we faced them in Mapendusi. Uh, but they are still a good team. They are uh, still a team that can play good football, that can create chances, uh, that can score goals. So we need to play our best tomorrow. If we want to get uh, anything from from Chamasi. Uh, today in training we tried to get adapted a little bit to the turf. Uh, we went to training artificial and yesterday was the other training. Uh, we went just to work on small details and uh, there's no time for more. Uh, we need to recover good because we didn't have too much time to prepare this, this game as most of the times. So the most important thing is to choose tomorrow the players who are going to be uh, fresher and, and the ones who are mentally ready to go for this battle because it's going to be a tough battle for both teams. Thank you, coach. Karibuni Komaswali. For any reason. Nah. No information in advance when we are playing key games to the opponents. Tomorrow you will see, but we are still uh, missing many players as the last games. And you will see some of them will be ready for tomorrow, some of them we will not be ready. The good news is that we are not missing anyone else in these two training sessions, so that's at least uh, uh, an advance regarding the last matches. And how do you see the title race? Sorry? How do you see the title race? NBC Premier League title. The title? You are always asking me the same for a long time. I continue saying the same. We are going to keep fighting every single game, even if we are not uh, having the chance to, to become champions again, because this is what I think I have to do. This is what I was educated about. And because this is what I think Simba needs to do as a club and, and what our fans deserve. But I have the same speech, I think, in the last six, seven weeks. It's almost impossible. Every day that uh, comes by, it's even more difficult because uh, Janga is not uh, making many mistakes. They are dropping some points now, and I'm sure that they are going to continue dropping points, so that means that we need to keep fighting. But uh, they are also going to win games, and they have a, a good advantage. And this is reality. And I always said I'm not coming here to to lie to anyone. Uh, it's very difficult, but we are going to keep fighting, and tomorrow we have a game, and we have to respect our club, our fans, and it's a nice game to play. We will try to win the three points to keep in the race. The beautiful game tomorrow. Apart from uh, aim to collect all the three points, the other side of it? I think we both are teams uh, which like to play a good football, which like to be on the ball. It's going to be a fight for getting the ball and try to take advantage of our capacities and, and the ability of our players because both teams have players who can make the difference, especially in the last uh, third. Uh, they have, I think, two top strikers. One of them played in Europe. Uh, the other one is the current top scorer in the league. So uh, I think... Uh, I mean, last league. So I think they can make the difference, but I, I also said they have young talents, they have good players in the wings, as we have. Uh, 
uh, and all these players can balance uh, any game. So I think we are we are willing to, or we are expecting to to see the best version of of these players. I hope tomorrow we see the best version of our players and and also of our players in defense, uh, not letting them to take advantage of their capacities. But I think on the paper it's a good game. But also when you are playing uh, big games between good teams, sometimes uh, it's also difficult for both of them to create the same chances we are creating when we are facing some weaker teams. So uh, I think we are going to try. Uh, let's see if our fitness level for both sides, if the turf uh, allows us to, to play our best football. But I think at least we are going to try. And I think the fans uh, is one of the games they are expecting to, to watch uh, in the season. This is about being realistic. And I'm answering the same question for I don't know how long time. We are going to fight till the end. And my hope is to win every day the three points. What the others uh, do, I don't care. To be honest, I didn't watch Janga playing against Dodoma. Because this is not what matters to me. I was watching games of Hassan, I was analyzing our last game, I was double checking our game against them in league in the first leg, I was checking the map and do cup game. This is my job. The things that depend on me, the things that don't depend on me, and luckily in the league we are not depending on us from the very beginning, even before I was here, I cannot spend any of my energy. And even less now, when there's no time for anything, when we are playing every three days important games. So from there, my hope is to win tomorrow. And then my hope will be to be Keita. And then my hope will be to be Janga in semifinals cup. This is my job and this is my hope. The last question. <laughs>